friends, the husband and I are going to be going over this big, huge tub of empties. Three months worth. Stay tuned. We're going to have his reaction on this video. Hi everyone, I've been saving my empties for a very long time and Bill is going to join me today to help us go through these. I'm going to have his reaction to these. Um, a lot of this stuff is kind of expensive and I don't think that our husbands realize how expensive it is. So we're just going to kind of book on through this because it could take a really long time if we didn't. So we're just going to grab things out of here. Nothing in any particular order. I'm going to talk about whether or not I really like them. And if it's something that I did like, I'm going to have him guess how much it was possibly, and then we'll go from there. And actually, he probably knows a lot about this stuff because he does help me pick out a lot of it. All right. From Wow Skin Science, we have coconut milk shampoo. This was supposed to be really good for hair that was falling out. I didn't like this very much because it made weighed my hair down a lot, and I have very fine, limp hair. So that was a pass for me. This one is from Pixie Beauty and it's a glow tonic. How much do you think that one is, honey? That one is $14.95. Ah, close. <laughs> the little teeny tiny one is $14.95, 15 or I don't know. They may have raised it to $18 now. But this one is probably more like $50. Lovely. <laughs> yep. Okay, from Kirkland. This is my minoxidil that I was using to, it's a hair regrowth treatment. Minoxidil is probably the only thing proven to actually regrow hair. And this is one of those ones that I stopped using because it made my hair feel really greasy if I used it too often. So, um, got any guesses on that? Oh, Costco Kirkland brand. I am going to say it was a two pack for $29.99. It was a three pack. Three pack. For how much? $29.99. $14.98. dollars On Amazon. So that was a pretty good deal on that one. Okay, one of my favorite things ever. This actually was sent to me. So um, this is the Dermatology Physical Tinted Moisturizer with an SPF of 44 Universal Tint. Um, this is so good. It is something that you can throw on after your skincare. You don't have to have, you know, the extra moisturizer and the extra SPF. And I love this stuff. I love the way that it um, helps my dry skin. It's such a good one because of having the physical SPF in it instead of the chemical one. So I really like that one a lot. This is one that I talk about all the time and he watches my videos. So what is this, do you think? Do you remember? Um, it's a moisturizing lotion. It is. Who, who makes it? Do you remember? Uh, they're from China somewhere. <laughs> it's from Korean or Japanese, actually. Japanese. Uh, Suko Yakusuhara. I have talked about this till I'm absolutely blue in the face. Here is their cream, their moisture cream. I go through the actual cream so very fast because I use this at night and I slather this on. And anytime I have something that is um, hurting like an irritation or... Or even if I have, you know, something on the rest of my skin on my body that is super dry, I will use this cream. I, yeah, I have three of them in here. I have one of the eye cream, which is my holy grail that I wear underneath my makeup every single day. It helps me not to look so crepey because I have super dry under eyes. And then, of course, the lotion, which is an, in fact an essence. So this right here, little numbers, how much do you think each of these are? Those are $25.99. $25.99, no. Um, actually, they're around $20 each. Um, so this is what, how many months did I say? Three or four months worth of empties. So you kind of know that you got about $100 sitting right here, which is always, always kind of fun. Oh, absolutely. <laughs> okay. So uh, this one right here, what do you think about this one? I'm not liking the packaging. It's pretty plain. I'd say $15. Okay, this is from Kylie Skin. This is her foaming cleanser. This, of course, as you guys know, is probably more than $15. I don't exactly know what it is. But this I didn't like because it didn't really take off the makeup. It didn't take off like if I was doing double cleanse with a balm or something. So it didn't work that great on me. And that and is not something that I will repurchase. if it works like it does on the Jenners, you all have big fat lips when you're done using it. <laughs> yes, we all have big fat lips. Okay, this is my favorite mm. shampoo. I use this all the time. I have um, two more of these. Um, Restoring Pure Body Naturals. Actually, I think I just talked about this. Did I just talk about this in a couple of my videos? Mm, probably. 
anyway uh restore and strengthen hair loss prevention therapy shampoo for men and women no parabens sls's no harmful chemicals and sulfate free yes this works i love this shampoo when i get away from it i notice that my hair is not as healthy and not as thick and i don't see the little sprouty hairs that you get do you get sprouty hairs hon uh, i get a whole head full of them <laughs> then what do you do with them uh Shave them off. Bick, bick them off and run them <laughs> down the sink. And then this one is from Hask. This is their Biotin Boost Thickening Shampoo, Biotin Collagen, and Coffee. Okay, first of all, anytime anything says it has collagen on it, do not be fooled because the collagen molecule is too big to penetrate our skin, including our scalp. So I liked this shampoo, but it wasn't as good as this one. So even though I have another one of these in my shower, I'm going to use it up and I'm going to stick with my tried and true. Professional Series Hydrating Argon Oil Mask. Deep conditioning and hydrating for softer, silkier, healthier, healthier looking hair. I do like this. It was really good um, for moisturizing my hair how did it do with your hair honey fabulous was I, it good oh it just made everything tingle oh good well tingling is sometimes good sometimes yes. not okay and then i have two of my very favorite in the whole world how many more of these do i have sitting around honey? uh probably four or five at least <laughs> i have two more of these sitting around because i buy them in bulk kenra volume hairspray 25 if you want hairspray that isn't crunchy but holds your hair and does not weigh it down this is the bomb and i will forever be a fan i've been using this for 25 years even before you met me long time ago that was a long time ago <laughs> okay what do we use this for babe uh you lather down on cow titties <laughs> what is it it's bag bomb bag bomb do you guys remember bag bomb we have used it for years and years and my dad used this yes on his animals and then we just learned that anytime you had an open sore or even if a baby has a rash this is super good we put it on everything we put it on our cuts we put it on all kinds of things anytime we get any sort of things so I go through it all the time and I would not be without it bag balm is one of those things that has an antibiotic in it it's very um, Vaseline type product where it's got that thick feel balm feel to it so it's awesome it does have a funky smell but the funky smell tells me there's medicine in it that's gonna work so I do like that all right we're gonna talk about a bunch of stuff that was sent to me City Beauty sends things to me all the time to test and i have a bunch of them they are expensive so i am going to tell you the stuff that i loved the most after i used it up the uplifting firming serum i did like it very much um i have another one that i'm using if i get through this next one and i feel like it has continued to do what i want it to which is i'm trying to always find things to take care of our sagging neck and our gels so um occasionally i do this stuff on bill believe it or not and so i do like this how much do you think something like this costs babe i'm gonna say 35.99 no this is probably more around 70. okay <laughs> invisicrate body balm i do like this very much but i don't know if this is 100 percent worth it or not it's a huge tub of stuff i think this again is around 70 dollars um i did use this on his hands a lot did you like it yes I yeah did. this is actually a really good balm um, and i use this a lot on her bum and it's very enjoyable <laughs> it does not use this on my bum I we do. use it on our i use it on my feet a lot whatever <laughs> it's it's a beautiful beautiful lotion and smells like heaven we love we love this smell what does it smell like mm, kind of a coconut coconut mango tanning kind of, oil tanning oil it's but yummy. yes it is lovable it's yummy have your men rub lovable. it on your behind uh, it's amazing <laughs> That's why they call it bum bum. Boom boom cream. Okay. Boom boom. boom. The multi action sculpting cream. Again, I love that these are fairly big jars. Um, I don't know about it being the best ever. I probably, if I was going to do one of the two, I would probably do the Invisa Crepe instead of the sculpting cream. I like them both, but again, they're very pricey. The one that I'm not super impressed with is the Blue Defense Hydrogel. I did use it up. But I feel like it's it's that blue light therapy and I don't know I didn't feel like it did a whole lot as far as Giving me a lot of moisture and I need a lot of moisture And then this is something that I have discovered within the last six months Which is the complete skin rescue. These are their 
vitamins for your skin but man these make your hair and your nails grow like crazy my nails have gone nutso in the past few months it does take about at least a month one of these jars is just a month supply so it does take at least a month for this to be seen on your skin and nails but i do feel like my hair is starting to grow a lot faster very, now very quickly yeah very and quickly. my skin is really loving whatever i'm doing to it very quickly or very very much too this is from la Ange, and this is their thicket cream i do like this however it's old and it's kind of gotten too thick um i use a spray instead of this how would it do you think it would thicken your mustache what do you think i think mm. we should use it on the mustache. i usually find just leftovers from dinner thicken your mustache very nicely <laughs> yes they do and the Kenra Nitro Memory Cream. This is supposed to have a three-day style of memory. This is actually why, what made me buy the big one. And I do love this stuff. But this little baby right here lasted me like two to three months, even before that. So if you're wondering about it and you want to just try the little one, that's good. And then I have two gloss treatments. Um, one is from L'Oreal. This is the One Step Toning Gloss Boost Shine Enhances Color. Is this purple? Yeah, this is for people that want the brassies gone from their um, hair. I like this. I like the gloss and I like the tone of it. But I like the one that I use more from Pravana. I don't even know if I have that in here because I don't have my Pravana one in here. I actually like Pravana better. Um, he seems to like my cool hair the cool color on my hair a little bit better than yes. the brassies. Yes. And then this one is just the John Frieda Luminous Glaze for all shades. It's the clear gloss. I've talked about this a million times. You guys know I love it. Oh, this is something that we need to talk about. This right here is Trish McAvoy's number nine Blackberry and Vanilla. This is one of my favorite uh, perfumes of all time. And I'm going to have, he knows what it is, but I'm going to have him smell it and I'm going to have him react to it. Delicious. <laughs> just delicious. I think it's sexy. It's very sexy. A little it's spritz musky. in this area here. A male will become very aroused because okay. this stuff is Okay, we don't amazing. need to talk like that, but yeah, okay. It is very, a very sexy, um, musky, um, has a little bit of fruity notes in it, but this is an amazing fragrance. And when it comes around to the holidays right now and they have the sets, I always pick up one of these because it is probably my number one fragrance of all time. I love this stuff. And he loves it. Every time I wear it, I actually get stopped somewhere and they're like, what are you wearing? So it's a beautiful it's scent. It's awesome. Yeah. It costs a little bit more, but it's totally worth it. All right, one more hair product. This is the triple sec from Dry Bar. I actually love this. Texturizes, amplify, amplifies, and refreshes. I love this. Um, I don't know if we've ever used this on your mustache. No, I don't think so. Uh, yeah, it's supposed to give lots of body. We could use it in there and, you know, fluff up your mustache. What do you think? Yeah. It's already fluffy um, enough, but... I'm always game for anything. <laughs> I do want to tell you, this right here, I use this every night, don't I, honey? Yep. This is from Cranicel. This is the Bifida Complex Serum. This is the exact same thing as, um, well, it's not the exact same thing because it's better. Estee Lauder and Lancome both have Bifida in, um, let's see, Estee Lauder Night Repair and Lancome Genifique. They both have Bifida in them. This one also has Galactomyces. It's brightening. It really makes your skin look younger. It's just a beautiful treatment if you're older and you need something to really boost your skincare. Bifida is a fermentation process and so is Galactomyces that they found that softens skin, smooths wrinkles, helps all those kinds of things. Maybe we should start using this on you too. We can try it or it just sounds like a bunch of BS, but <laughs> we'll go either way. Okay. Whatever, whatever. All right. Well, we're trying to help these ladies not talk to them about BS. Uh, let's talk about the glycolic wa body wash from Pixie. This was sent to me. I really, I liked the wash itself. I I felt like it got you really clean. I don't know about the glycolic part of it because when you're doing a body wash, it goes on and it comes off pretty quickly. So the glycolic part of it is supposed to do some exfoliation and I don't know if that would be something that would exfoliate that quickly if you were just using it like that. And then I have two of these balms. I am a balm fanatic. I would much rather use a, a cleansing balm than I would rather use an oil. And I have the Good Molecules one, and then I have the e.l.f. one, the Holy Hydration. And I I like both of these. I think they're both really good. They both take up makeup really slick, and I think that either one you can't go wrong with. What's this? Another? 
more uh, minoxidil. Yeah, and so what do we? I usually ripe it, put that on my back, and that's why I have the really long old man back here. It's about this long. It works every time. Very sexy. Works every very, time. Very sexy. Love it. Okay, tons more skincare from Radiant Soul. There is a cleansing oil. I don't. I didn't like this one at all. It's a charcoal cleansing oil. It was black when it came out, which didn't bother me, but it didn't take the makeup off like I wanted it to, so I won't be repurchasing that one. One of my very favorite ones is from Pixie. It's a hydrating milky peel. This has plant cellulose in it that actually does the exfoliating so it's extremely gentle and i could use this every day i really like that one okay this one is from dr brandt uh it's supposed to be like some uh, magic in a bottle that gets rid of your wrinkles yeah needles no more from dr brandt so i feel like this is something that you need to well, run out i've and tried get. it and as you can see i'm very wrinkly around the eyes <laughs> so we obviously know this is crap <laughs> see the wrinkles and the next one is what? I didn't, I lost my glasses. What is it, honey? Anti-aging cream. Eye cream. Anti-aging eye cream from, I don't even know who this is from. It's from it doesn't work. Probably purchased from Disneyland. And as you can see, <laughs> same effects. Absolutely nothing. Imagine Dermatology Hyaluronic Hydration, honey. This is actually good because it does have, trying to, uh, has hyaluronic acid, polyglutamic acid. It has urea, trellose, lactic acid, and dermal amino complex. This is one that I have repurchased a couple of times. This, I'm just out of it and I forgot about it. I'm going to set this aside because I will be repurchasing that super hydrator fantastic for your hydration i love it all right so i use up always a ton of um lip glosses from buxom and from city beauty which one do i prefer honey uh buxom no he's wrong oh. <laughs> i prefer city beauty because i do feel like it has a little bit more of the vitamins in it that help plump the lips and you can use this one as a treatment twice a day once at night once in the morning and it really does help those vertical lines that you get buxom is a beautiful product i have one in white russian and then i have one in selena and it's very tingly on the lips yes i, I have done that before i have done that before on him and he does like buxom a lot that's why he said i he thought i like buxom I because love buxom. he does like it when i do this at night and then i just reach over and i put a little bit on him he he really does does like that cooling effect or when he gives me a kiss at night and yes. gets the transfer so yes. city beauty is my absolute favorite but buxom is a close second what is this one honey it's a uh, deodorant lumi deodorant he, since i found this for it's for underarms and private parts since i found this my i have been such a happier person because when you just put deodorant on anywhere else in your body besides your underarms it doesn't seem to work very well and it works fabulous on the private parts <laughs> It's amazing. <laughs> we like it. We like it a lot. Both of us like it. And yeah, it's something that I continue to repurchase over and over again. Now, I will say if you have any, um, sometimes if you have any open cuts, like if I shave my armpits and I put it there, it does sting a little bit. So if you have very sensitive skin, be careful with Lumi. It, there's an ingredient in it. It must be the active ingredient that helps you not smell. So yeah, this is a product that, what is it called? Uh, good molecules, uh, toner. Niacinamide brightening toner. I, I talked about this a million times, you guys. I, it's one of my skincare products that I'm never without. I will put down some of my skincare videos so you guys can see what of these products I do use the most, but this is one that is always in the rotation. I always have two backups of that. Okay, so two um, setting sprays. Actually, this is not the actual setting spray. What do you think of Max Fix Plus, honey? Been around I, for years and years. I, what do we think I, of it? I, I, we love it. Do we like uh, it? We do. It's very refreshing. Very like, refreshing. You get little drops all over it. Very we like that one a lot. And then, of course, the Morphe Continuous Mist. Um, this is one that sets down. Ooh, I've got a little bit left in that one even. So this is one that sets down your makeup and mattifies everything. So it's nice going on, but it, it does dry. it smells amazing. It smells. Does it smell? Mm -hmm. Oh, I don't have any. I never noticed any smell in it before. But yeah, okay. The next one um, from Vegamore Grow Plus Advanced Hair Serum. This did nothing for my hair except for make it greasy. So this is one that I would just, I saw this on, I think it was Facebook I was on. And I ordered a three-month supply of it. Used it for three months and it did nothing. Crap. So. Absolute crap. <laughs> it's absolute crap. Anything with vegan or something in the title is crap. Okay, so this I put in here because my husband is about to tell you all about this. What 
melatonin for sleeping. These are Amazing. chewables, and we discovered this last year when, when it was just a time when we, both of us were having a hard yeah. time sleeping really well and somebody mentioned melatonin and how great it was and we don't use this every single night he doesn't use it on nights he's going to work because it will actually make him oversleep yes but he sleeps like a baby with it i feel like the next morning that i still have it in my system so it takes me like a half a day so i use a half of a dose of melatonin he uses the full dose this is a really good one because we were using gummies for a while and they have a little bit of extra calories in them yep. but these are these don't have any calories in them and we both it's we, the best for sleep it's absolutely wonderful for sleep we both love it this from x lash i have been using Oh gosh, you guys, I got that was X Lash, not X Lax. <laughs> Just to clarify. I've been using this for like five years. They sent it to me five years ago and I continued to repurchase it. It's what makes my eyelashes super long. I love this stuff. I will never be without it. Um, this was really expensive. This is the Nyad Voicemail Mask. This is supposed to be super hydrating. It comes out in a weird funky tube. I am I wasn't super impressed with this. It it has a terrible smell. It has a it smells like crap. <laughs> what is it smell I'd like? Say Apparently we're not allowed to say that. Okay. So it's crap. Okay, so, but what is it? It smells like pepper and it smells like and pepper, vitamins dirty and diaper. <laughs> It's just this sewer, nasty, sewer line. It's nasty. just disgusting. It's disgusting. Yes, it's a nasty smell. But if you are somebody that likes that supercharged moisture, it might be good for you. Oh, this is good. These are the LA Girl Pro Color uh, Foundation Mixing Pigments. I mix this into my foundation like it just said yeah something like that this is the blue one um, a few of you have asked me about this i think i do have a video on showing you how to use it or at least telling you how to use it um I, this is a whole one that i've used up i have another one as a backup i have the white and it just it works so well if you're somebody that is cool toned and you get orange or you find that foundations are always too orange for you if you're somebody that finds you have an olive complexion and that your foundations don't look that kind of olivey color or that kind of um, deeper color you might try this one and the yellow one together that one might work for you um, it does help make it a little bit more green which is what olive is so maybe try that see by petra the color corrector I have gone through a whole one of these. I have another one in rotation. I'm trying to use up some others. The one that I'm using right now is from Tarte. It's a color corrector. What do I do this for, hon? It's for correcting your color. And where? And I'm still white, so obviously it's not working. <laughs> so under eye corrector, absolutely fantastic. But um, I have a Tarte one that I'm using. I am nowhere near as impressed with that or Charlotte Tilbury which we think Charlotte Tilbury is quite overhyped. Yes, very overhyped. Very overhyped and very expensive. Here's another fragrance that you can't smell because it's gone completely. But it's juicy. We love juicy. I have love a whole juicy. entire collection of juicy. This one, I can't even see that. This one is one that um, I just used up in my purse. So that one's in there. Um, Revlon Color Stay Prep and Protect Primer Base. I've talked about this on my channel a million times as well beautiful primer for sitting underneath your makeup and helping with the spf i think it's a 34 36 on the spf so good we absolutely we i absolutely love it i uh, i guess i love it too. he I loves it too yeah it, he yeah. likes it too okay this one remember i just talked about the galactomyces this is from physicians formula and this is a galactomyces spray it's a lot more than you get in other uh skincare products and again the spray is beautiful and you can just spray it on your hubby or spray it on yourself bill doesn't do facials very often i kind of went out of frame sorry about that guys um but he does like to try what i try as far as skincare um he'll like it because it feels good one time we did um the depuff stuff that in the anti-wrinkle stuff that you put around the eyes on him i'd gotten a I, I don't know somebody sent me one he loved that and he thought that was great and it worked amazing as you can tell by the large bags under my yeah, eyes yeah and if you can tell right now he's got a little black eye i don't know how he did that but yeah he's got a little black eye so we never know how he does Nine one one. all right emptied out a fenty beauty amber this is their her cream contour well it's the contour but she calls it her cream 
bronzer. I emptied out a whole one. I'm so proud of myself. I don't ever do that. But this was fantastic. I loved how creamy this was for mature skin. It sits down so pretty on the skin. And it will eventually go down to a powder-like product on your skin. So I loved that. I think it's great. We're almost coming to the end here. I have a skin brightening anti-aging serum with tranexamic acid. I love tranexamic acid, but I think I need one that has just that. Actually, this has tran tranexamic acid, arbutin, vitamin C, E, it, licorice, and hyaluronic acid. That's really good. So I don't know if I meant to repurchase this one. I'll put this one aside and try it again as well. Okay, these are my, excuse me, that's not who the company is, but it's the ultra fast drying drops. I use these every time, don't I, babe? Yep. And I don't ever mess up my fingernail polish, so it's really fast. And if he does my toes for me, he uses this on my toes too, so my toes don't get smudged. He's really she doesn't use it on mine, though. I usually just pick out a color and that's all I get. Yeah, it's usually, we usually pick out green or blue for him. Yep. So we've done black ones, but then it just looked like his toes yes, were dead yes, and, yes. and it wasn't a very good look. Purples, greens are fabulous on your toes. <laughs> all right. This last few products, Amica uh, Perk Up Dry Shampoo. Not too impressed with this. It just weighed my hair down. <laughs> Honey, don't say that. Oh. I can't use you if you say that. Try again. Take two. Amica Perk Crap. Up Dry Shampoo. Crap. I didn't. I didn't like. Boo! <laughs> I didn't like this because it weighed my hair down a lot. Fantastic truth treatments. Uh, retinol five percent is what I used. This is super strong though. You will make your skin peel, and you have to be careful with it. I've been. I bought the big tub after I used this one because it's a way better value. But this is not cheap. This is really expensive. But I do get it when I get at least twenty five percent off at Skin Beautiful RX. And if you haven't shopped with Leah, we love Leah. She's a fantastic gal. We've she's given us lots of PR, and we love her. Um, Milk Makeup Hydro Primer. This is the gripping primer. What what would you think about a gripping primer, dear? Mm, something you put on your hand to grab me by my lovely ass. How wonderful I am. I can't use oh, you if you oh, say oh, at oh, ass to Never you. mind. Hey, what would you think about gripping primer, honey? I would think that'd be something you put on your hands to grab my lovely butt cheeks and tell me how much you love me. Oh, Firm yeah. Firm grip. Firm grip on the butt cheeks. Well, I don't know about that, but yeah, it's a good one. It's really pretty under makeup, and it does hold your foundation on really well. And we do have a few more, but I'm going to stop it there because this video is way too long already. I hope that you did enjoy Bill being here with me. Um, he doesn't usually have a lot to say anyway. Well, he does. He's kind of been quiet today. i got to learn to keep my mouth shut or I say offensive things. <laughs> he doesn't say offensive things, but he says words that won't allow my video to be put up on YouTube if we say them. So we're going to stop there, and that is it for today. And you want to do the outro? Subscribe. Keep subscribe. Hit the like button. Watch as much as Get you can. Get all your friends to Miss Melissa and Beauty. Get the firehouse because she's smoking oh, hot. God. Right. Okay. Love you all very much. Thank you all for your support. We got. We really appreciate you guys and how you support us. You have no idea what it means to our family. So thanks again. Love you. And I will see you all in my next video, but Bill probably won't. So Goodbye. bye, friends.